Tell your mama for all I care. Dude, I, take it easy. I got lumbago. You might want to quit that. <laughs> that drunk's got mean friends, believe me. Oh, oh hell. Oh, Wasting God. my time anyway. Oh. I appreciate it, Arthur. There's no sense of humor, the fellers around here. How drunk were you? Just normal drunk. Anyway, I should probably hit the breeze. I'll be at camp if you need me. Maybe try keeping your mouth shut next time. Oh, come on. <laughs> You'd all be bored as rocks without me. Hello. You get yourself in jail. You huh? know, he ain't Good. a bad fella, Down all things considered. That over. man's head's going soft in his old age. You better watch out for him. Listen. Fool or not, that drunk's a friend. Now see you mess with him again, I'll see to it you don't do much after. Screw your threats. That piece of shit comes around here again, he'll get what's coming to him. Listen, that your fella? The old one? And what do you want? Yeah, he's mine. Well, you better watch out for him. He's looking for a knife in his belly from some of the boys here. A beer, please. You ain't scaring nobody. Don't drink it too fast. Partner? Who's this then? Hello, welcome. Hello, mister. You remind me of a feller I used to know. Who's got mouths to feed? Sorry. Can't put my finger on it. You take care now. You need something else? Can I get a room for tonight, please? Room's all yours. Head on up.
Need to freshen up a bit? Got a bathing service. Uh. 
Thanks, partner. Enjoy the morning, mister. Hello. How you doing? Doing just fine. That's the spirit. All the best. Bye now. I need to have a word. Just calm down. That's right. Keep going. Yeah. Now, come on. Yeah. Ah. 
Just wait a second, girl. Creep up on you, you know. Huh? <laughs> Mr. Morgan. How are you? Well, sir. What are you working on? Do you know anything about alligators? Only the basics. Avoid them wherever possible. <laughs> well, did you know that in the last 50 years, we've killed 90%? You say that like it makes you sad. They're beautiful creatures. <laughs> Let's see how you speak when one of them's got you in a death row. Yes, I will make some creature a very happy lunch one of these days. Let's try and avoid that from happening today, hmm? Well, you stay there, you'll get a great shot, but then you'll get eaten. <sighs> what a way to go. Why don't we take this boat out, and I'll protect you. Come on. 
Get in the boat. He'll be fine. Well, if you really think that's necessary... If you carry on shooting from that bank, you're gonna wish them wolves had eaten you. Really? Yes. The 10% who survived, they're the nasty ones. All right, then. Um, oh, oh, I saw a movement to the north of us. Oh, and to the west. Oh, and to the northwest, there. That's probably where we should look. Let's go look, then. When we find one, line me up so I can get the shot. I'll try. Don't get too close. We'll scare them away. Close, but not too close. Got it. Right. Right. There, in the cane break. That's a likely spot for one. Take us around the island until we see something. Okay. Last year, they brought 10,000 skins out of the swamps of Lemoyne alone. Well, Gator's got some catching up to do there. Cases, trunks, shoes, boots, belts, Bibles even. There, in the channel. You see its head? Poking up there. Line us up to it. Closer now. Closer. Excellent. Beast in repose. All as calm as the predator lurks. All right, now. The other spots were northwest and northeast of here. You know, in the season, there are more alligator hunters down here than... than... alligators. Maybe you can take a photograph of one of them, then. Very droll. There was even a tour company that let excursionists shoot from the deck of a paddle steamer, chugged up the waterways and churned whole bayous into mud. Thankfully, the state legislator put a stop. A paddle steamer, huh? Now, why didn't we think of that? <laughs> yes, yes, there. Oh, no, he's gone. Ah. Can you stop the boat just there, off the island? Sure. If we stop too long, locals are going to start getting curious. Just just there, please. So, so I'm facing the landmass, right? Now, look, there's an alligator back in those palms. Could you... Could you run in there and coax him out? Coax him? Please, he's quite something. If I could take that fellow's likeness, it might... It might just save him from the taxidermist. <sighs> Fine. But maybe I want this monster stuffed and on display. <laughs> That's the spirit. Oh, he's awake! Uh, Come on, Gator. <laughs> Nearly got him eating me. I don't know what I'd do without you, sir. I... Conservationists, not killers. If we investigate the area to the east, we can call it a day. 17 feet, 19 feet, 21 feet with a five foot head. What? They found some big bulls in these parts. Surely they did. There's 20 foot gators here, and us two idiots are sitting in a 12 foot skiff? No. This is in the 70s, 80s. All the really big gators have been hunted out and killed. More the shame, I say. It's terrible. Ain't shame to this rowing fool who values his arm being attacked. Oh, look! On that little beach. Boars! If we're in luck, an alligator won't be far away. Saving alligators, but you don't mind that pork chop getting butchered. Pork chop isn't in danger of extinction. <laughs> it's got it! Quick, quick! I must get this shot! Uh, not quite there. Turn. Just a little turn, please. We caught him. In the middle of his dinner. Oh. Oh. Nature. In all its glory. And cruelty. Could have been you if you stayed on that bank where I found you. Counting on your help with this. This isn't a hunting trip. Please put it down. 
We can congratulate ourselves on a job well done, Mr. Morgan. Take us back where we began. Anyway, I hope you got something worth printing. Oh, surely. The nation will see these beautiful beasts for what they are. Killing machines? <laughs> no. Well, uh, yes. Maybe that's not a bad thing. This is America, after all. We hold a love for killers that borders on macabre. Loving killers is part of our makeup. Maybe. Maybe. That should do us. Yes. These pictures you're taking. Yes. They gonna be any good? <laughs> I certainly hope so. Though I doubt it. The subject is magnificent. The backdrop, jaw-dropping. But the agent of beauty is a talentless fool. Although maybe I'll strike a few lucky shots. You sure do make me laugh that way you talk about yourself, Mr. Mason. Well, I'm good for laughing at, if nothing else. I didn't mean it like that. I know. Still, I feel such a fool around you, sir. Don't worry about it. Oh. I foresaw many an ignominious future for myself, but never damsel in distress. Well, uh, good luck, Mr. Mason. Thank you, and to you too, sir. Try and stay out of trouble. I shall certainly try. <laughs>